Hi there, fellas and fellaettes. Whoa! And felines. Welcome back to Gene Forge, aka Jenna Forge, where you create Jennifer if you really want. I don't know why you'd want to. Jennifer's silly. She's in a a show. Yeah, Deadland Tombs. What's up here? Probably more. Hello? Yeah. Don't kill. No! Don't shoot! Can't bloody get there from where I am. Tit off. Tit right off is what I would say if I were so inclined. Oh boy howdy, someone's gonna get blown up now. Here, have some healing. Oh, never mind, I ain't got enough stuff. Munch! That's alright. That's alright, that is... Here you go. Where am I? Which one? I don't know which one. Can I see the health bars? Okay, you can click on that to heal them. I thought I tried that in the past and it didn't work. Holy jeez. Holy cheese. Lots of it. Never mind. <clears throat> Why is this idiot such an idiot? How did you get over there? Okay, I thought you were stuck. Ah. Okay, what we got over here? Get out. South Bridge. Probably continuing on the way to Kazg. Which must be over there. Looks like a little village there anyway. Full of little villagers. They're little compared to me anyway. And my cool army. Where am I going? <clears throat> Even I'm an idiot. How is this dug out by rivers? Have you looked at that map? This isn't what rivers do. Oh, from this vantage point, you get a good view of the sea south of Susia Island. Far to the south, you can see the mainland. Close enough to be barely visible, but much too far to swim. To the southwest, you think you can see the mast of a ship. However, your view is blocked by a wall. If you walked west a little, you could get a better view. Okay. Cheers for that. All right. Let's get rid of... Oi. God, there's always someone in the way, isn't there? Can you shoot? Yes. I wanted to shoot the other one, but that'll do. Alright, go and tank it. There we go. Any more around here? Doesn't look like it right now. Come here, mate. There we go! Ah. Should we go and have a look? Have a look at the beautiful view. That's, that's a mouldy green sea. I don't see the mast of a ship. What are you on about? Over here? Word. Stay away from me. Stay away from the summoner! Which I basically am because I summon things. Or create them. Shot. Haha. <laughs> I do love a nice chain reaction because it's chain experience gainage as well. To the south you can see a ship. It is the same strange ship you saw a few days ago just before it bad worded your craft and left you stranded on, on this horrible island. It's not horrible. I'm loving it. It will never threaten you again. How do you know? It will also never sail anywhere again. The fire from your craft destroyed its sails and it ran around it ran aground on a reef. As you watch, it sinks slowly below the water. Soon it will be gone. Well, it's taken a while to sink, isn't it? Th that solves one mystery. Unfortunately, it leaves you no closer to escape. Just create another raft. I can clearly create things. Where are you going? I'm just going to stop asking. Never makes sense. What is that? Speed spores. Speeds up everyone instead of just the one I use it on. Yum. I guess. Right. Um, we're almost done here. It would appear. Oh, almost done here. It would appear. Oh my god, I've got two ears. That means I can hear stuff, and I don't want to because 
I don't know. I didn't think that far ahead, and I couldn't think that far ahead before it was too late. And it just all derailed, didn't it? Yeah! Here we go again. The chronicles of being unable to hit anything. Fucking acid arse. Ow. Why does this happen sometimes? Mental magic? I don't care about that. Unless that's days, which is a useful spell at some point. Would be nice to maybe get some points in that. Because days is very useful. Hi, again. No! I did so well last time, I think, maybe. I'm not sure. Whoa. Had a bit of a twitch again with my worm friend this time instead of Clive. Push! Now this is more like it. Yeah. That's how it should go. I even got Dosh for a good performance. Oh. You study the book at the base. It's interesting and complicated. You don't know enough about magic to be able to learn from it. Can I put some points in spellcraft? There we go. Oh, spellcraft one. Bloody hell. I just basically got two spellcraft for free. I'll take that. Sure, it's expensive, but... Yum. There you go. Isn't that glorious? Hiss. Oh, it didn't say puff. Or whatever it says. So you didn't actually appear. Sorry to break it to you. You don't exist. Yum. Can I have like a ring that I can wear instead of these useless ones? Magic shaping? What does that give me? Artilla and Vlish. Wait, what? Wait, I thought that was battle shaping. Oh. That's thards and claw bugs. So I think I got a battle shaping here as well, didn't I? Must have looked at the wrong one earlier, like a foolish mortal, but now I've got both, so that's just fine, that is. God, basically charged to this place early game. It's not too hard, and you get loads of stuff. This is going to be peasy. Imagine when I come back, when I go to town and make a whole new army full of these new... God! Newly learned skills. Everything's going to be glorious. Great, an empty one. Nothing down here, eh? Just some boners. Right, are we done here? No, a little bit more. Another tomb, that's always exciting. I do feel like I remember getting some equipment here. Just one piece of equipment. But if they don't bury them with stuff, I guess maybe I won't. It's a good job the enemies keep going for my creations instead of me, since I'm the squishy one. It's a good job I can't hit them, otherwise they might die. What have we got? Not enough to help me. Not enough to help me. Bloody hell. That's a huge disappointment, that is. Oh, there's another one. The final one. Hopefully it'll have something especially good to make up for that empty one. Oof. Oof. There we go. <clears throat> and blessing magic. Which is for war blessing, so... I don't know. And about that... Yeah, yeah, blessing magic. War blessing and speed. I'm a can of Reeves from... Matrix and speed. Yep. Yeah. I've got loads of dosh. That's not what he sounds like. You're breathtaking. Oh. Where did you lot come from? Good, you can die. And feed me. You're not going to get there in time, which is a bit of a shame. But which means you're going to explode someone, so get away. Yeah, Clive, go tank it, like you always do. Oh no, he's going to get double exploded, but that's alright, I'm out of here. Ugh, he still lived. God, he's too good. 
Two burl. He's a burlap sack. That's what he bloody well is. Right then. Is this the exit? Right, yes. Yes it is. It's not blocked up or anything. More enemies is always nice. Anyone else? Anyone else before I go? Probably not. No, there might be more lurking around here. But they're only giving five anyway. Let's bugger right off. Alright, um... Shall we stop in at Pentel? I guess. I guess we better do it, since... We need to recover anyway. Make new things. We might as well go here. It's reading time. Absorption. Vore. It's not very fun. Great, we got this again. Let's just not have creations for now. It'll be simpler to walk around alone. You speak with the guard for a while. The servile is completely obedient, cooperative, and in awe of you. However, he doesn't know anything very useful. Can I... Excuse me. Why can I not take these? Are you going to attack me? If I... My crime was seen. It's not a crime, because I'm your god. So you can't do anything about it. Oh, maybe you really can't. I don't know. Or maybe you have to take five things before they turn on you. I don't remember. Look at this place. It's like so many other places in so many other spiderweb software games. At least I can take this stuff. Not yours. It is now. Yum. I love get getting... What the hell was that? Someone's having a recover. I love getting living tours and stuff. Things that'll actually be immediately useful. or well, not so much immediately, but... You know, things that I know will be useful. Unlike the ice crystals and stuff. You know, in theory they'll be useful, but I'll probably never use them. Yum. Yum. What do you mean I can't carry it? Buggering hell! Right, let me go and close it then, so... So I know I haven't looked in that one. Now we gotta go find a shop quickly. Huh? Ah, blah, 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 blah. What's out here? Wooded Valley. And I guess to the right is gonna be Thorny Woods. But we might as well discover the path to it when we can. Right, let's not go around there yet. You enter the village of Pentil. It's more like a town. The village makes me think of wood and huts. It was quite a bit more than a village, actually. This was a larger fort, perhaps, probably the administrative center. Though you weren't sure at first, it is becoming clear that this island was once a major shaper research center. Major shaper. Whatever caused your people to declare Susia forbidden, it must have been very dramatic. Yeah, probably, probably got rid of all the porn on Twitter or something. I mean Tumblr. As you enter, the effect on the servos here is dramatic. They stare at you... What? You just used the word dramatic in as many sentences. I mean twice. They stare at you in awe, even considering reactions to you so far. It is remarkable. Some of them fall to their knees. One of the guards walks up to you, staring at the ground and shuffling his feet. Oi, respect me. Um, look up here. Look at me eyes. Shaper, welcome to Pentil. In the name of the Abayas, we welcome you. We are grateful that you have returned to, to rule and guide us at last. He walks back slowly, not daring to look directly at you. Nice, nice respect, God. When you meet the gaze of one of these meek creatures, they look away. For once, on this isle, you are meeting serviles who treat you like serviles elsewhere do. Ah, isn't it nice? Chesh? I already met- oh, right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's you. Servile guard looks very beaten down, as if he has seen a lot of intense combat recently. We already met! His shoulder is bandaged, and his face is bruised. He looks familiar. I wonder if I would have got an experience if I'd had them help me. Fudge knows, because it's kind of acting like I haven't met them, so maybe I didn't get the quest to help them, because I already did it on my own. I don't know. 
Welcome, Shaper. I am Chesh. I have come from a fierce battle on the fields to the west. It is good. No, you haven't. I did it all. It is good to see you are well. What are you doing now? I am only part of the only part of the town watch until I am better. The moment I am at full strength, I will be patrolling the bridges to the east, watching for rogue serviles and other taker scum. Comes. I can't wait to begin fighting anew. In the in the name of our creators, having you here inspires us all, Shaper. Ha! Yeah, yeah, it better do. In an American accent. Who are you, farmer? Ah, Farmer Joe. Farmer, 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 farmer Joe. And his brother, no one actually. This is one of the servals who works hard to grow food and raise meat. The hard work has left the creature with rough hands and strong muscles. It's very different from the servals back home. She looks, she looks up to you in awe, clearly seeing the saviour of her kind. Word of your acts must have gotten around. Is there anything I can do for you, mighty shaper? You have but to ask. Uh, yeah, give me some stuff for free. Oh, tell me about your farm. It is outside of the west gate. Now that the gate has been cleared, we are starting to return to our lands to repair the damage that has been done. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm looking for information. Is there anyone here who can help me? Rydell, or Riddell, Rydell, I'd probably say Rydell, is the leader here and the one with the most knowledge. He is the leader of the Obeyers. You already said leader. God. I know that he would be honoured by a visit from you. His hall is at the west side of the central building. Never mind, you can return to your work. Thank you, Shaper, you're very kind. I'm kind for letting you return to work. Can't bloody... Can't bloody carry nothing, can I? As in, I can carry nothing. Is there a shop around here? What you find in this library is simultaneously impressive and pitiful. This place is a monument for the servile's worship of the Shapers. The shelves here are filled with scrolls. You pick up one and inspect it, and then another. And another! And another! They are records, bureaucratic notes of the colony here before it was abandoned. They aren't the originals, though. They are copies, painstakingly made and kept legible by servile scribes, in case the Shapers ever returned. Oh, how nice of them. The records are worthless, though. Whatever information they contained has been rendered obsolete and useless by years of abandonment. So much time was wasted here, just because the servals thought your people might wish it. Isn't that nice of them? I'm surprised they don't worship all the random useless knowledge as, like, some kind of religion thing. I'm not saying the Bible is useless knowledge, I'm saying these knowledges are, because that's what it said. It's obsolete. God, you just can't please some people. What have we got in here? Stuff I can't take, no doubt. Oh, I can take a book. A book. And another one. And another! Ah! Uh, what? How? Oh. You got... Hang on. Let me just extra make sure here. I, when researching stuff, how many points to put in mechanics? Yeah. I did read that you don't get experience for unlocking stuff in this game. But I don't know, I thought I did. I thought I did for one of the doors. Fudge knows though. So yeah, you might as well just save living tools by using unlock. It's actually really, really fun sharp. It's really fun using magic for a change. It's very useful. Come here. Learned Dana. Oh, Lacrimosa. No, spelt differently. As in Issei Lacrimosa of Dana. At last you meet a servile who is doing a proper servile act. What? Haven't they all been so far? Worshipping me and stuff and respecting me? Serviles are generally used to rec <coughs> for record keeping and other less physically taxing jobs. They're too smart to be used for farming and too weak for fighting, but they do it anyway. This female shows you the respect and awe that seems the norm here. Shaper, you're, you inspect us at last. I am Dana. Welcome to the Records Hall. I maintain it and train other servals to maintain it. I hope it meets with your approval. Can you train me in maintenance? Maintenance. So that I can maintain my weapons? No. What sort of records are stored here? 
My ancestors were changed, charged by the shapers to keep the records of affairs on this isle, and for years we have done that. It has been difficult pulling people away from hunting and farming, but we have always trained more to keep these records. Sometimes they have rotted and been damaged, and we have recopied them. I'm sure everything here is intact, and as the shapers would wish it, I hope our work pleases you. This is madness! Um, I don't know. Oh, they probably don't want to hear that it's madness. Is there any way I can help? Maybe I should say you've done well. No, because that's too controlling. You should always do what the shapers wish. Is there any way I can help? You are kind, shaper. Many old books of records have been lost over the years. Some to the west. Oh, I wonder what they're going to want from me. Some to the north. Many around Kazg. We have tried to find and preserve them, but with little luck. The more such records you can bring me, if you find any at all, the better we can serve you. I bet Kaz want to destroy them or something. So there's probably a quest for that. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I guess you've done well. It's not me to say that, but sure, that's what... Oh! Fuck. Fuck. What sort of records? Anywhere I can help? Oh! Hang on, I missed a big old hefty thing because of a double click. That's fine, I just saved it anyway. The joys of saving regularly. Um, anywhere I can help. You've done well. Oh, thank you, Shaper. You're very kind. For so many years, so many of us have wondered if there was any sense in doing what we do. It is good to know that we are doing our Creator's will. No, there isn't any point. But if that's what they want to do, you know... Keep them happy, I guess. I don't want to. I don't want to demoralise them and say everything you've been doing is worthless. We will redouble our efforts to make sure that the knowledge here stays intact. But at the same time, you know, me personally, I'd want to be honest. You know, tell them that it's not useful anymore and they should do something else so that they're not wasting their time. Make the most of your life. But I guess that's not really the point of this game. I don't know. Anyway, I have another question. Dana looks around the hall nervously while she speaks with you, constantly looking for anything amiss which might displease you. Uh, yeah. There's a whole lot of clothing being worn around here. I'd prefer a nudist society, thanks. I wouldn't actually, probably. I don't know what the serviles look like. They've got weird elephant noses in some of the games. Well, most of them, but you can see them more clearly in others. Anyway... You keep records? Do you know much about the history of Susia Island? Very little. The records are, well, we don't really understand them. But I have gathered a little bit of knowledge. Uh, do you know anything about the canisters? I don't really need to know that, do I? But might as well. Um, I know that they were discovered here. I have records of their construction and use. They are capable of rewriting the very code of life, hidden deep within your being. The shapers then stopped making them suddenly and fled the island. I do not know why. So are they like gene forgers? I don't know. Well, I do, but I'm not going to say anything. The shapers then stopped me Oh, wait, I already read that. She looks at you closely. Shaper, you have been using them, haven't you? Though I have never seen one of you, you look strange to me. Excuse me? Excuse me? She fetches an old mirror, worn and cracked, and shows you your face. Oh, yes, handsome chap. Hmm. Anyway, is there a point to this? She is right, you have changed. There is a cold look in your eyes, and you think you can see a faint glow underneath your skin. Very strange. Oh, I'm just becoming a light bulb. One of the canisters gave me body light passive ability. Um, do you know why this island was barred, or what it was used for? Records tell us that huge amounts of supplies were moved around here, and many, many shapers came and left. The most important shapers were Defniel. I remember that name, I don't remember what, though. I also remember Trashkov, as in Trashkov, uh, Karata and Donet. What they were doing and why they left, I have no idea. I am so sorry. Hang on, I just want to make a note of that so I can remember those names. Because I'm interested. I'm getting re-interested again here. Not that I ever lost interest, but playing it again and actually reading it out loud, I'm kind of taking more of it in, in a weird way. Anyway. I can tell you, though, who keeps the good records. His name is Toivo. 
He is a foul taker in Kazk. He jealously guards the most valuable records of the Shapers, even the locations of their most useful artifacts. To learn more, find him. I don't need to make a note of that. I'm going to meet him anyway, eventually. Um, right, here you go. Have some Shaper records, I guess. I'd rather help you than Kazk. But I think it does decrease my um, being liked by Kazk and other things. Other people. She takes the records eagerly. Thank you, Shaper. We will catalogue and restore these precious documents. Since you left, I haven't left. We have gathered up some meagre payment for your kind help. Oh wait, since Shaper's left the island, probably. She go. She gives you a few coins. Cheers. A few. How? Wait. What? No, you didn't give me any actually. Excuse me. You gave me ten experience. And no dosh. Don't tell me I'm at the cap. I don't know what the cap was in this one. No, 2022. I don't know what I had before, but okay. I'll take your word for it that you actually... Was that you, Dana? You silly cow. No. Well, I mean, kind of, because she didn't give me money. As in, it did, she didn't tell me how much she gave me. God, I'd rather know. Yeah, um... Take as many as I can. Just in case, like, four of them, five of them, six... Just in case six of them is enough to get some money. Get some money? Do you know what I mean? Right now I can't carry some mere gloves. Natalie. This servile is young, but she moves as if she bears a heavy burden. Her hands show the signs of much hard work, but her robes are clean, indicating she has been working inside for a while. When she sees you, she kneels. Stop it. You're going to get your robes dirty. A single tear runs down her cheek. I've heard, but I did not dare believe. It is true. After all our waiting, you have returned to us. Welcome, Shaper. I am Natalie, head of the farmers. I have trained with serviles as you would wish. Trained these serviles. Tell me about the farmers. We servos always grow food for the shapers of Susia Island. El grew. Fuck! When they left, we felt they would one day return, and we wanted to be able to resume service to our creators. So for generations we have trained our children to grow food. Of course, being able to eat it ourselves helped us survive to serve you better. Excuse me? Who gave you permission to eat my food? God! I saw the state of your farms. I also cleared the rogues away from the west gate, so, you know, pay me. Oh, Shaper, I know. Thank you, thank you. Even now, we are sending our farmer sending out farmers to repair the considerable damage. Thanks to you, we will not starve. You came to solve problems when all was, was worst. Shouldn't you say at its worst? I don't know. As we were always taught you would. Ah, Yeah. Natalie continues to speak with you, still on one knee, still overwhelmed. Ah, the feeling of power. Just as a dragon deserves. Uh, why are you so worn out? Been busy! She bends lower. Oh, bend over. Leaning closer to you for strength. Get away! Not long ago, my bonded was lost. His name was Hodge. Hodge. Oh, I was hoping it was Hodge. He was cutting wood. A vlish poisoned him and he died. Interesting, Vlish don't poison people. They bloody... Maybe they do in this game. All I remember them doing is, like, mental effects. Which was annoying. Or something like fear. Good game. For a time, I questioned how the Shapers could abandon us. I wondered how they could let these things happen to us. In the end, Rydell came to me and told me how it was all for the best. He told me how you understood all, and you made sure it was all happening for a reason. No... I don't work in mysterious ways. It was a great comfort to me. Please, Shaper, forgive me for my doubts. Oh, Rydell right, was wrong. We never gave a thought to you. Um, no. No, I don't want to say either of these. What does it mean to be bonded? What the hell do you think? He was my mate, my love. Interesting. You thought you knew that servos were fertile. Oh, though you knew that servos were fertile and could reproduce, because it would be a waste of effort to magically create all that are needed, you never thought about their mating rituals and such. It, it isn't something shapers pay much attention to. They bloody well should, shouldn't they? Oh, the top one is a lie, but the second one just sounds like asshole. 
Although it says, I don't know, made to suffer is a terrible thing. Hang on. I hate being given these choices because they're both not me. Right, I was wrong. Uh, let me just see. Natalie blinks a few times. She is silent. She tries to process what you've said. Then she seems quietly to reject it. No, Shaper, that is not the thought of a true Shaper. What our creators say is truth. For making us, we owe them all debts. Please do not lead me from the true following of your kind. Well, well if she wants to hear it, I might as well. Bob. Right, I was right. I, I, I believe you, but at times some of us, not me, you understand, but some of us question it. I do not. If you say how things must be, that is how things must be. I know that now. Even if I say the other one, though, you don't accept it, even though that's how I say things be. God. Okay, it doesn't look like it makes a difference anyway. It's just flavour text by the look of it. Anyway, next time. Have we found a merchant? I don't know. doesn't look like it. Found a bloody wood house full of wood and houseageness. Godwin. Oi. How dare you have God in your name? I am the only God around here. Right, thanks for watching. Next time we'll continue exploring Pentil. And uh, that's probably all we'll have time for. It's a lot of reading, isn't there? Yep. Bye.